Can you teach us more about geometric series? Let's remind ourselves of what a geometric series is. Here we have the summation from k equals 0 to infinity of a times r to the power of k. a represents the first term and r represents the ratio. Now the question is, when do these series converge? Well, let's take a look at two examples. Here we have the summation of 1 third times 5 thirds to the power of k compared to 1 third times 3 fifths to the power of k. Now let's think about the really far off terms. Let's take the limit as k goes to infinity of 5 thirds to the power of k. Distributing the k, we get 5 to the power of k divided by 3 to the power of k. Now, which of these is going to grow faster? Well, 5 is larger than 3, so 5 to the power of k is going to grow a lot faster than 3 to the power of k, meaning this limit is going to go to infinity. That means the terms we're adding are getting bigger and bigger, so this series is going to diverge. Now, let's take a look at the limit as k approaches infinity of 3 fifths to the power of k. Distributing the power of k, we get 3 to the power of k divided by 5 to the power of k. And this time, the denominator is going to grow faster, meaning that all of these terms at some point are going to be approaching zero. So at some point, we're adding so little to the series that it's not changing it much anymore. This means a geometric series will converge when the absolute value of the ratio is less than 1. Because at some point, those terms are going to get very, very small, and they're not adding very much anymore.